Hey, what's up, Young from Insider Korea, and I'm home right now, and I'm actually hungry, so I wanted to go uh, cook some lunch for me, and I'm actually gonna make an uh, instant noodle dish called japaguri, which was made famous by a movie called Parasite. I'm gonna actually go ahead and share the recipe with you and cook it and have lunch, and the recipe is coming right up. Let me first go over what you need. Uh, first, you're gonna obviously need a pack of chapagetti and a pack of nuguri, and then some steak. I bought chopped up steak. You can buy regular steak and chop it up and cook it. Olive oil and about five to six cups of water. And all that's ready. And let's get started. Okay, so let's get started. So now when you get chapaguri and you open the pack, you're gonna actually get uh, the noodle and then you know three of these. So you wanna uh, kind of put this aside. Uh, we're gonna put this in the water first with the noodles, okay? And then when you open naguri, the pack of naguri, you're gonna see these two packs of you know like flakes and then uh, uh, soup inside, soup base inside, and then seaweed. Now I'm gonna my personal preference is that I'm gonna leave the seaweed and the flakes out just because I don't like seaweed in my noodles. But you need to keep this here. So uh, what the first thing you do is you actually, I like to usually crack the noodles in half. So go ahead and you can, you can just put it in as is. You don't have to crack them in half, but I do it usually. So there's that. And then nobody, same thing. Put both of them in boiling water. So again, as I said, it's uh, about five cups of water, five to six cups of water and you just let it boil. And then again, as I said, I will leave out the flakes from naguri and the seaweed, but I will go ahead and put the flakes from chapagetti. So let me go ahead and put that in. Now, as you're cooking the noodles, uh, you wanna go ahead and cook the steak. So what I'll do is, oops, the wrong one. Okay, and then just put a little bit of olive, olive oil. And then... Put some beef. Now, um, you know, just go ahead and cook the meat in a separate pan. I'm using a wok. And then the noodles are also being cooked on the side. Okay, so the steak's pretty much cooked. Like, I don't want to overcook it. So I'm gonna turn the heat off for the steak. I'm gonna come back to the noodles. And the noodles also look cooked and ready to go. So let me turn that off too. Okay, so after the noodles are fully cooked and the steak has been cooked, what you do is you go ahead and drain the noodles so that you only have about one third of the water in the pan or in the pot. So, and then what you do is you go ahead and put uh, the noodles in the wok. Okay, and let me bring that back to probably like medium heat. Okay, and at this point, you go ahead and put the powder from chapagetti. And then noguri. Now some people only put two thirds of this. I'm actually put all of it in it. Okay, and then let it come to a boil. Okay, so here it is, ready to be served right now. And um, when I cooked it, I said about, leave about one third of the water in the pot before you actually mix it with steak. I think that might've been a little bit too much, but I cooked it and then the noodles kind of soaked in the water, so it's okay. Uh, but if you wanna go 
Uh, you can also do two, uh, one fourth or one third of the water left in the pot and you can uh, start mixing with steak. So uh, if you like that video, please hit the uh, like button. And if you're new to my channel, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the videos coming up on Korea. And I'll see you in the next video.